By now you have heard about sludge and humus and how it settles out in the primary and secondary treatment process. Have you ever wondered how all of that sludge, also known as biosolids, is disposed of? Let me tell you. The sludge is pumped directly from the holding tank into a mixer where it is blended with a precise amount of polymer before continuing on to the rotary press. Upon entering the rotary press, the sludge polymer mixture is fed into a circular channel between two moving filter plates where the dewatering process begins. As the press moves the sludge around the rotary channel, a progressively larger amount of water gets squeezed out through millions of tiny holes in the filter plates. Upon completing one full revolution within the press, the sludge exits the rotary channel in cake form, where it is then conveyed into a roll-off truck body. The plant generates about 40 cubic yards of sludge per week, with an annual production of approximately 2,000 cubic yards. The sludge is disposed of in many ways. It can be turned into compost or applied directly to the land for reuse and farming. Sludge can also be converted to energy through a digester. If none of the reuse options are feasible, sludge can be disposed of in a secure landfill.